www.love the number two jamradio.com is the queen of all things indie. We are live at this media extravaganza. I've been saying it all night just like that. It's good. I say extravaganza. I don't know, but it's something. You want to try it? No. <laughs> like, you a hater. Thought, no, no, hate you a hater. No, no, no. We could have had a moment and you it's, ruined it's, that for us. It's dope. It's just not I, you know, oh, I. I don't know what's for you what's okay. Well, tell the people who you is then. Check this out, man. Hey, this is King Bro, San Diego's finest, man. I'm out here doing my thing. Cali made, Texas paid. Separation coming soon. Gassed up out now. You know what I'm saying? Born to win, coming soon. We working. Okay. How long you been doing music for? Shit, I've been doing music my whole life. Your whole life? My whole life, I came out the pussy with some headphones just on. Beating, beatboxing, beatboxing. Yeah, with the headphones okay, on. I can dig that. Real shit though, since I was like 12, 13 years old, I've been doing music. Okay, you say you from Dago? Yeah, I'm from Dago, man. You know what I'm saying? Shout yeah, out to you. You gotta know if, if I said it like that, then yeah, I gotta know something. Yeah, okay, oh, look. you know something. Look, about look, something. Look, 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 look. Shout out to the whole East Dago. Shout out to the whole Southeast Dago. Shout out Facts. to East County. Shout out to nigga everybody. Nigga. Shout out to El Cajon. Yeah, East County. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's my shit. I used to stay out there. I was in the military, in the Navy, so you know. Oh, you that, yeah, that was, you know, or you know. Coronado Island, Miramar. Miramar Facts. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I actually went to college there, too, uh, in Scripps Ranch. Ah, oh, you hey, that's that's that. It was on the address. Yeah, hey, great, everybody from Scripps Ranch. If you on the live, tap in. Right. You in Atlanta now, right? Nah, I, I live out here. Oh, you in Asia? Yeah. I thought I you was. I didn't know that. Yeah, Goddamn. I gotta, I gotta come through to the show, drop some music, and yeah. 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 On the 30th, we got Jam the Cramming live, live song submission. So you come perform your song, oh, yeah. and you know, say I'm gonna tap in with you and get with uh, my November intern 30th? back November 30th. Oh, unless you got something else going on. I mean, I probably do, but fuck it, I'll make time. You feel me on the ground? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> one time, for the one time. What do you want to get from this networking experience? I mean, to network. You know what I'm saying? They say, Absolutely. yo, 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 network, network is, your is your network. network. Absolutely. You know like, and really, more than anything, I love connecting with other individuals that are creative, that are trying to do the same thing that I'm trying to do because, look, you never know. you The one person that can open that door that's been locked on you, he might be in this motherfucker tonight. She know. might be in this motherfucker Fast. tonight. You think they're going to they gonna come to you? No. You, no, gotta go, you got to put yourself in the rooms that's going to get you the boom. Absolutely. So, I'm so what's, what's the boom look like to you? What does that look like? Like, what are you trying to, you know, your next goal in your music situation that you got going on right now? So here's my thing, right? My whole mission... Well, my music is to A, tell my story. Tell your story. B, now, hold on. Is it a horror story? See, that's the funny thing about, about my movie. Okay. You know what I'm saying? And I call it a movie because my life is a movie. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's an action flick. Mm. Sometimes it's a porno flick. No! Oh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Yes, Wait a minute. All right. Okay. Sometimes, I'm back. sometimes it's a motherfucking drama. Sometimes it's comedy. Okay. You feel me? But it's 100% authentic. It's going to okay. make you laugh. Now, that's a rarity. You feel me? It's gonna make you wet. All that shit. You know what I'm saying? My movie is it's it's real. You know what I'm I saying? wanna watch this movie. Hey, I'm just saying. I'm about the box office yeah. needs a hit. Look, look, it's coming soon. We finna boom. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I like that. Yeah, it's coming, coming soon. Boom. We finna boom. I so like that. the name of my project is called The Separation. Okay, the separation. So tell me what like the main single off the separation is. The title track called The Separation. Okay, so hey, self entitled and the name of the track. The separation. Okay. Like, is it important um, as far as like the order of the tracks? You know what I mean? Because I know you said you dropped the album, and I'm kind of yeah. curious because you know now we're living in the age of singles, you know? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so, okay, I dropped a whole bunch of singles. I probably put out like 10 singles and shit, but yeah, you should. after putting out 10 singles, I'm like, it's time to drop a full body of work, Absolutely. a complete body of work. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I want to tell a story with my, with my music. And so the separation is probably track number. Two on the project. Okay. Why not the first track? Did you do like an intro? Yeah. Okay. I didn't know what you was doing. Niggas, niggas don't even do intros no more. I know. That's why I didn't know. Niggas don't do skits no more. They don't. They don't I, nigga, I love but the you skits. You bringing it back? You bringing it back? I mean, I, I ain't never thought it left. It's just certain people get it and certain people don't. Like I said, my shit is a movie. I want to okay. paint an experience for you. Feel me? So sometimes you might have to give them a little backstory before the song drop. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You might have to give them a little. Mm. One two with the one two. A little razzle dazzle, right. you feel me? Just type shit. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I could dig yeah. that. Yeah. So the name of the track once again is called The Separation. Yes, I do that a lot so that yeah. people that are tuning in they'll yeah. see it and hear but, it and stuff. That's okay. part of interviewing. But I'm asking this because I want to know, as far as the separation is concerned, what do you want people to walk away from that particular track once they hear it? Say they may not get to hear the whole album, but they do get to tap into the separation. Yeah. What do you want them to walk away with after they bam that hoe? Okay, so 
I'm the type of artist I draw influences from Nipsey, Tupac, Scarface. You know what I'm saying? Like them type of artists. So my whole theme and my whole concept with the separation was is that everybody can't go with you. Hmm. I mean, that's deep. We'll just let that breathe for a second. Yeah. Okay. Everybody, everybody can't, can't come with you. I like that. <laughs> I like it. Because here's the thing, right? Before you can elevate, you got to separate. Mm. Right? Because you, you might have them childhood friends that you love dearly. Mm. You feel me? You might have that bitch that you got history with. Mm -hmm. But they ain't shit and they don't want to see you win. Mm. Because you chasing your dream and elevating yourself and make them feel some type of way about them sitting on their ass not chasing their dream. That's what it is. That's where the hate kind of... I mean, mm. yeah. Or you, or, or you might not just be no good for me, bro. I love you, but nigga, you keep fucking up, going back and forth to jail, nigga. You don't never come to the shows. You don't never support the music, nigga. You ain't never got nothing positive to say. When I'm like, hey, I'm about to go bust a move and do this. She's like, ah, why would you do that? Mm. Oh, that's not going to work. That's always something nasty right. to say. Nigga, shut the fuck up. We're right. going to do this shit regardless, nigga. I don't need nobody to help me with my shit. Like, yes, it helps when you have people on your team. And I do have a couple really good friends on my squad, man. Shout out to Keisto. Shout out to Sandy 3P. Shout out to the rest of my niggas. But... I mean, it's really us versus everybody. So I can feel that, us versus dead everybody. Weight. Dead weight got to go. Now, speaking of dead weight, if the, don't be no dead weight when you tap in with him. But if you want to be some, you know, good, healthy weight and you're trying to grow, then the tell the people. Yeah. I like that. You got bars for days. Yeah. Tell the people how they can tap in with you one more time. Well, check us out, man. If you want to stay tapped in with the young pro, king pro nigga, man, make sure you follow me at... K, no, my bad. At, Are you lying no, here? No, 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 no. All right. no. I, you know, I got a slight name change coming. You feel okay, me? Because okay. I, ain't, I ain't really too young no more, okay. but shh, don't tell nobody. I'm gonna tell nobody. All right, yeah, so make sure you follow me at Y O U N G P R O S S M G on all social medias. That's Young Pro S S M G, man. Support your music group. We out here working, man. Cali to Texas, you know what I mean? Houston to Dago. Exactly. Everything Fuego. And who you rocking with? What? We fucking with the Love to Jam. What you mean? We yeah. Love to Jam Radio. Yeah. I miss love you guys. Queen of all things indie, and we'll be back.